Why 90% of traders fail and the secret to be part of the 10%. I'm going to demonstrate why most traders are doomed to failure and lay out a free stage process to maximize your chances of success. I feel stories deliver a powerful message. So let's start with a story about Steve. Steve has $20,000. He heard you can make a lot of money as a professional poker player. Steve has a rudimentary understanding of the rules of poker and no experience playing it, but he decides to go to Vegas anyway with his $20,000. Needless to say, Steve and his $20,000 are swiftly separated as the pros take all of his hard-earned money. Now this seems ridiculous in the context of poker, but it's incredible how many people do this with trading. Both poker and trading require an understanding of probability, risk management, an insight into human psychology, and most importantly, a mastery of one's own emotions. If you are trading without a rigorously tested strategy, then just like Steve, you are gambling, you are not trading. Regardless of what book you read your strategy in, whose signals group you're following, if you do not have tested, proven results for whatever method you're using, you are gambling. So how do you join the 10% of successful traders? I've broken it down into three simple but truly demanding stages. Think about it, this is a high income skill that is extremely scalable. This was easy, everyone would do it. There's going to be a lot of work required at each stage. The first stage is studying. I want you to become a learning machine. Use every resource at your disposal to learn as much as you can about technical analysis. Books, mentors, coaches, Twitter, YouTube, and most importantly, I cannot stress this enough, this is key, pay attention, subscribe to my channel down below. I'll wait, take your time. Done? Oh, perfect. Let's move on. So your goal should be to find a strategy that resonates with you. For me, that was Elliott Wave Theory. For you, that could be classical charting or any of the other hundreds of strategies that there are out there. As a basic example, let's say you decide to incorporate a strategy that buys at support levels after researching supports and deciding a simple strategy like that would work for you. So you don't just want to say, okay, I'm going to test buying at support levels. You want to put into place strict protocols and checklists which you follow. For example, I require two hits on the support and on the third hit, I will aim for a 1% profit or a 0.5% loss. Stage two, testing. Stage two is the unpaid internship to see if you get a job. You backtest your chosen strategy across multiple different time frames on whichever chart you're planning on trading and see if using past data it would have been profitable. Now if you find your chosen strategy does not work, then it's time to go back to stage one. However, this time you have two options. You can either start from scratch and look for a new strategy or you can refine your current one. The refining process is where most people struggle in this stage. So to help make your lives easier, I'm going to use our earlier example to show how we would refine that strategy. Take the initial conditions for entry. We had a support, which we would buy at, after two hits. This time, we could alter that and make it three hits and retest. We could also change our risk levels. This means instead of aiming for 1% profit, this time we'll aim for 3% profit and see if that makes a difference. This process can be repeated again and again using intuition from what we see on the charts and data we've collected from all our different sources. No magic formula, no secret $1,000 course or paid group I want you guys to sign up to. This is the real route to earning six or seven figures through trading. It's not sexy, but it's the truth. 
So you finally have that strategy which works. What to do next? Forward testing. We'll take a paper portfolio, which means no real money, or a small insignificant amount which you're willing to lose, and test this in the real markets. And now, if your forward testing is successful, congratulations, you're ready for the final stage. Stage three, apply. The emphasis on stage two is finding your profitable strategy. The emphasis on stage three is sticking to it. We're not focused on making money, we're focused on sticking to our system. The profits will follow as long as you stick to your system. Although this sounds easy, you will find that your greatest challenge are your own emotions. While emotional tax varies from strategy to strategy, it universally increases with position size. Trading a $100 position is very, very different to trading a $10,000 or even $100,000 position. As to not let our emotions make us deviate from our system, we want to very slowly increase our position sizes. There are numerous exercises traders can do for self-control, and I will definitely do videos on this in the future. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope this video added value to your lives. If you'd like to see more of the art, follow Ben on Instagram. If you'd like to ask me any questions and interact with me, comment below, or better yet, go find me on Twitter where I'm a lot more active, and you can also help decide the future content of this channel. So subscribe below, join Team AK, and let's build richer lives.